Welcome back everyone to Tarantula Exotics and today we have the video I've kind of been dreading. It is time to rehouse our Black Widow or Latrodectus Hesperus into a bigger enclosure. She's outgrown her little vial and I think it's time we treated her something right. Um, you know, I'm not nervous or anxious around the Black Widows or anything by any means, but this is my first Black Widow and I think what makes it the hardest to do is that she's decided to reside right on top of the lid. So we'll see how that goes. Let's see if I can get her out safely. Obviously that's number one priority with anything is making sure her health comes first. Uh, my health in this case is a very close second. So let's make sure that goes okay. But without further ado, let's get into the rehousing video and hopefully you guys enjoy this. All right, so last up, we're gonna do the Latrodectus Hesperus. This is the Northern Black Widow. Uh, this shouldn't be quite too bad as far as skittishness goes, but we do have a different problem for this one. I'm gonna show you where this one is residing currently. Uh, hopefully I can get it to show on camera. But yeah, she is right near the top and she actually just kind of ran down. That might help us. So apparently she's camera shy, which is actually a good thing. So yeah, so we're going to open this up and basically put her in here. Uh, I'm gonna use whatever I can. So I'm gonna go off to the side here. Um, Again, recording, this isn't quite as important as making sure she transfers in safely, but I guess we'll see how this goes. So I'm gonna locate her really quickly because she isn't off the top anymore. And then we will begin the transfer. It looks like she's gone into the moss. So I'm gonna open this up. Okay, so let's see if I can get this on camera. Let's open it up. In fact, I'm actually going to stand behind the camera so I have a better vantage point for this one. Okay, so she is right there. I can see her on the top. Okay, if you guys can see her or not. And she's now on me. So we're going to try and do this as gently as possible. This was not meant to be a handling video. I guess it's turned into one. Okay, well, since she's off, don't want to bother her or provoke her in any way. Is there any way she'll go into the cage? Nope, of course not, because that would be far too easy. I kind of see her crawling up there. I'm gonna go for the lid again. Maybe I can try and chase her into here. Oh, there we go. Okay, she's on. She has webbed me a little bit, so. Okay, she's back on her lid. Oh, she just jumped in. Uh, she's got a web down there. And she's coming back up. Probably should have closed the lid there. It's actually good. Hopefully I got a good shot of that too. Okay, I have the lid in my hand. We are going to lid her. I'm gonna try and get a real quick shot on this camera here. Right on the top. I don't think I can really see her. I'm gonna try and zoom in on that in editing, but I think we're okay. So let's get this lid on. I want to go this way. Perfect. Lid is on. She's in there. We're all set. All right. So that wasn't too bad. Um, I guess just handle a black widow by accident. But as we can see, I don't have any bites or anything. It was perfectly normal. She is perfectly calm. And most importantly, uh, we got her in and she's safe. So that is pretty much it for the black widow rehousing. All right, so that was a little unexpected. I handled my Black Widow, which I wasn't intending to, and obviously as a disclaimer, I would never recommend anyone handling a Black Widow. That was purely by accident. I had to maintain my cool. I had to make sure I was calm. I didn't want to provoke her in any way. Uh, they're not super defensive as a normal spider. They hardly ever bite. I was obviously lucky that this one didn't bite me, but at the same time, part of that is also composure, making sure that you react 
with the spider's best interest in mind, and I think I was able to do that to a appropriate level. But hopefully you enjoyed that. Um, I certainly did. That was an adventure for me. Hopefully, if you did like it, you can leave a like down below. Make sure to leave a comment as well. Uh, if you didn't like it, leave a dislike. If you want to let me know in the comments why you didn't like it, um, I'm sure I have some guesses. For example, an accidental handling of a Black Widow is not something I would traditionally promote. Um, and I'm not doing so in this case either. So please, if you do have any kind of Latrodactyl species, don't handle them. Don't do that. Um, it just wasn't intended. So yeah. But that's going to wrap up the video for today. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.